You need to tell me the answer, okay, by passing on the mic to that person. The rest of you will be writing the answers in the notebook. So you have the notebook with you, everybody. What? Yes. So uh, on the uh, total, fifteen questions are there, and for every question, you need to write the answer, okay. And the person to whom I ask will speak the answer, right? So let okay, us. Okay, ma'am. Okay. Have you all written the questions, uh, the sequence of the questions? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So the first question is going to be for uh, Aryan. Aryan, my God. Yes, ma'am. Let me start the screen sharing, beta. So the first question is, does she is tall? Is this question correct or incorrect? Does she is tall? No. It's a no. Okay. And then what should be the correct question? What should be the correct answer for this? Rest of you, please write your answers in your notebook. If you think that no is the answer, you have to put comma and then write what is the correct way of asking this question. Please tell me, Arun. Arun, I need answer immediately, not after discussion. Please keep that thing in mind. Okay, second question. It has proceeded. Second question is for Mayank. Mayank, simple present tense tells us about the routine and habit of an individual. Yes or no? I'm um, yes. Okay. Can you tell me one sentence in simple present? Please do not discuss. Please tell me immediately. Nobody will support him. And rest of you, please write your answers. Aryan, have you written your previous answer and this one also? I would take the PDF from yours. I wake up at five a.m. You wake up at five a.m. Uh, tell me any other uh, simple present uh, uh, sentence with he, she in it. I'm repeat. Use he or she in the simple present tense and then make a sentence. I, you just use I wake up at instead of I. Please use he or she. What will be the sentence then? Ma'am, she go to school at. Uh... Seven seven a.m. She go to school or she goes to school. Ma'am goes. But but right now you said she go to school. 
Ma'am goes. Yes. Okay. So shall I put a yes here? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Rest of you are writing the answers or not? Okay. Let's move to the next. And the question is for Rishab. Rishab, the abstract noun of inclusive is? Inclusive is ma'am uh, both A and B. Are you sure? Yes, ma'am. What is the meaning of the word inclusive? Ma'am, ma uh, special type thing. Special? Ma'am, ma equal to all. Equal to all. Hey, uh, this is what uh, just Ansh told you? Yes, ma'am. And see, everybody, please do not work for others' betterment by making them cheat. Work for others' betterment by making them, letting them try. Okay, so please, this is not a good technique. Be transparent, be true to yourself. Okay, uh, Big Vijay, peril means... Peril means? This first. First? Danger, danger, danger. Danger, dangerous? Danger, danger. Okay, can you make a sentence with uh, peril? Peril. He's Write that sentence. Yes. Speak up the sentence. He's very... Uh, they look very peril. They look very peril. It would be like they look very dangerous. I want a sentence from peril from everybody in the notebook. And then uh, Mayank will answer. Mayank, you've already answered, I guess. Sorry, Ansh will answer. To be fish out of water means to be ordinary. True or false? False. Okay. And then what does it mean? Awkward. Right. So uh, first you all are supposed to make the sentence with peril that is the question number four and then you all can write the answer for uh, question number five everybody after this Arav be ready Digvijay what is it Okay, Arab beating around the bush means to run around the garden. Yes or no? Ma'am, no. Then what does it mean? Shivam, who is this person telling him? Yes or Shivam? Who is sitting next to him? Um, so, Yash, please do not try to talk. Ara, what is the answer, Bitte? What is the meaning of beating around the bush? Um, Dhadia. Okay, that's good. Yes, do you have any idea? What is the me meaning of beating around the bush? No confirmation will help you. If you know it, know it. If you do not know it, tell me that I don't know. Okay, Daksh will tell the meaning. Daksh, beating around the bush. Near. Sorry? Near to the answer by guessing question. Okay, yes. Correct. Daksh, now next question is for you. What question can we ask to know a spelling? Um, how do you spell it? Right. Let's move to Elda Madhav.
Frida Kahlo was a Spanish or a Mexican? Mexican. Correct. Let's move to um, Ansh. She drew the dash culture of Mexico in her portrait. Indigenous. Which one? Second. With an I or with an E? Yes, Indi. I. Okay. What is the meaning of indigenous, Ansh? That is, that started in one place. Great. Now the next question uh, will be answered by Atharv. Athar, Rohan have a friend named Sohan. Is this sentence grammatically correct? Yes, ma'am. Okay. It's incorrect. Can you tell me what is the correct sentence? Can anybody tell me? Raise your hands and tell me, what is the problem with this sentence? Dick no, has. Yes, the problem is has. Rohan has a friend. Okay, who else is there in the class that I cannot spot? Anad. Anhad. Anhad. Okay, Anhad. Yes, me. Anha, does Rohan is strong? Is the question correct? Yes, ma'am. Okay. No, it's incorrect. Can anybody tell me the correct question? Does Rohan is strong? Sorry? Does Rohan strong? No. Yes, what could be the correct question? Ma'am, yes, he's saying does Rohan is weak. No. <laughs> Nobody knows what's the problem with the question. This is the similar question to the first question that I had asked to you people. Please remember everybody, yesterday we did a question answer technique. We use the words like do you know or uh, does he work. Here we are using know and work which is an action and we use action only with do or does. Now here does is there, but strong is not an action. Strong is your quality. So when you are, you want to know the quality of a person. If you have this quality or you do not have this quality, we use the word is. Okay, only is. So is Rohan strong? Is Rishabh calculative? Is Big Vijay tall? Okay. Or is Yash short? These are the types of questions that we ask for the quality. But if you want to inquire about the activity of a person, you have to use do or does. Have you got my point? Why are you people fighting Aryan and Yash? Is it the matter to fight? I want all of you to write at least two questions starting with is so that it has a quality and I will listen it from you people. Please write is and any subject with a quality just like is Rohan strong. Make it faster, everybody. Two questions. Wherever you are writing. 
make two questions using this technique have you done it mayank yash rn arav especially you all four i'm going to create a special quiz for you people because you belong to elementary classes and i can find that attention span is little lower so make sure that you are taking notes properly otherwise i have to go for the you know everyday test for you people especially four of you and now all four of you will be speaking your questions right now mayank tell me the questions that you have written yes ma'am tell me the questions that you have written using is mam does rohan is strong but che does rohan is strong is a wrong question that is what i am telling you the correct question is is rohan strong yes ma'am then you have to create two questions like this have you created no ma'am then why are you not doing that you are busy with aryan do it give Sorry, mic to aryan give mic to aryan what is he doing aryan tell me how many questions have you created and ma'am please start doing that right away ma'am is is arav is okay party is arav is party now we have two uh, is in it please do not use two is is arav healthy is arav fit is yes, arav strong arav. okay only one is will be there what is the second question ma'am is mayank short okay now pass on your mic to yash yash two questions please you are not supposed to ask from behind you have to answer on your own yash ma'am atharvis tall okay you are telling me this but now through the question you have to ask me is atharv tall which means kya atharv tall hai is atharv tall okay what is the second question have you made questions yash you have not made questions quickly make make another two questions i will come back to you after entire round give it to arav now arav tell me two questions that you have created yash make two questions for the arav blank am aryan is russian is aryan russian is aryan okay not aryan is russian another question please don't make fun of others try to use any other word and uh, you know non hurting words in case you are using your classmates name is athar very tall any other question why are you after athar's life we have other students also make another question is daksh is tall is daksh is tall again two is is there make another question tall ko chhod do aur koi quality any other quality yash is short you are telling me ask me the question how will you ask me the question anad bhaiya is very fit okay you are again telling it to me anad is fit बट आपने मेरे से पूछना है तो आप कैसे पूछेंगे स्टार्ट योर क्वेश्चन विथ मैम स्टार्ट योर क्वेश्चन विथ विच विच वर्ड विल यू स्टार्ट योर क्वेश्चन विथ आरव is start with is is uh, anhad are fit 
is again is our fit is anhad fit are you getting the point ara yes ma'am are you understanding what i'm trying to say beta yes ma'am make about your uh, mother and father then chalo make questions about them make two questions about them and then i'll come back daksh tell me two questions daksh could rishab is go for, with me sorry could rishab go with me uh you are correct in asking questions but it it is a question which is not related to the quality you are not taking permission from me you need to just confirm from me the quality of rishab is rishab reliable is rishab trustworthy is rishab honest such questions you are supposed to ask me is is it rohan is it... is rohan is rohan very honest is rohan very honest okay any other question is your class teacher strict daksh are you paying attention daksh yes ma'am another questions please okay tell me is uh, let me take you towards some entertainment side so um is the uh, virat kohli uh, smart who is going to answer me where is the mic is virat kohli smart yes ma'am yes ma'am yes so now i have just asked you the quality of virat kohli similarly you are also supposed to ask me the qualities of the people around you or the things around you using is and that person's name and then the quality now ask me but these the pucho rishab is fit is rishab is fit okay is rishab is fit delete one is okay is rishab rishab, right any other question ये तो ऋषभ ने ही आपको बताया था क्वेश्चन आई हर्ड दैट एनी अदर क्वेश्चन अथर प्लीज डोंट टेल हिम लेट हिम बी इंडिपेंडेंट व्हाई डोंट यू गाइस अंडरस्टैंड योर इंडिपेंडेंस इज मोर इंपॉर्टेंट देन एनीथिंग एल्स इन द वर्ल्ड इज अथर इंटेलिजेंट ओके आस्क अबाउट अभिषेक बच्चन यू हैव सीन अभिषेक बच्चन इन मूवीज आस्क अबाउट हिम Is Abhishek Bachchan do good acting? Okay, again, you are now using the action. I'm talking about quality of Abhishek Bachchan. Is Abhishek Bachchan? Abhishek Bachchan healthy. Is Abhishek Bachchan healthy? Okay. Uh, talk about uh, Salman Khan. Is Salman Khan healthy? Sabhi healthy hain. Koi aur bhi quality kar lo. Is Is Salman Khan bodybuilder? Is Salman Khan bodybuilder? Okay, fine, good enough. Pass it on to Rishab now. Rishab, quickly. Is Rohan intelligent? Is Rohan smart? Very good. Move to Ansh. Or it's Madhav. Who's that? Madhav. Is Suresh handsome? Okay. is goat eating grass bachche no ings no actions only sorry ma'am yes is ans intelligent yes he is yes he is certainly he is intelligent yes he is very intelligent i know he is very intelligent okay move to madhav 
is mohan stylish is ro is john naughty is john naughty okay uh, move to digvijay is unshot and is <laughs> stupid okay really i mean please don't ask uh, such uh, such hurtful questions you're not allowed to ask any of such okay in uh, informal language no slangs please uh, anhad question is ansh naughty okay next what is the next question can anybody tell me the next question please is ansh is is ansh from aurangabad okay right um now i'm asking another question from you people is everybody attentive here is everybody attentive okay is everybody uh, is everybody powerful here yes ma'am okay is everybody is everybody tall in height here yes ma'am no or yes somebody was saying ansh was yes. short no ma'am no ma'am <laughs> okay last question is everybody um is everybody fit here yes ma'am somebody said no yes ma'am okay all right let's move to the next one and the question is for anhad anhad please attend to this question beta just a second right so here is the question what's the meaning of set off which is the correct answer to finish a journey to finish a journey and let me click that and that's an incorrect answer who can tell me the correct answer i mean answer is already there to start a journey you remember that the rat set off for a journey to the far off island far off land so set off means to start a journey okay i gave you this example also when you uh, you know i told you that when you come back from your hostel to your uh, home and then back to the hostel you say that i set off for the hostel i start my journey for the hostel right set off means to start a journey to a particular place next is for digvijay digvijay has answered it madhav has not answered it or uh, digvijay who is who has not answered yet okay when you have empathy with someone no you understand the person you understand the person's family you understand his or her feelings you can feel the pain and joy of the person and fourth you can feel the pain and joy of the person and that's the correct answer okay um it's a new game this question is for madhav elder one it's a new game is the sentence correct yes now you must be wondering why it is incorrect please notice yes. that the can anybody tell me the correct answer anyways i'm does it's a new game no bachche does tabhi aayega na jab koi action hoga new game is not an action ma'am it is a new game correct so the problem is there has to be an apostrophe yes it's a new game which means it is a new game not its together okay these are the small small hints that uh, you know uh, destroys your grammar or if you understand those hints it can build uh, up your grammar very well now last question is for uh, atharv this is svm school building 
is this question or sentence correct? No. Then what should be the correct? F S of yes. Where? After S V M. S V M school building. School, school, schools. Yes. Schools. Very good. Thank you, ma'am. So you got ten on fourteen. Uh, total fifteen questions were there. One question was not marked in here. So as in, like you have got eleven on fifteen. So five students uh, probably have got uh, incorrect answers. And I think this is not really satisfactory response. You still have to give me a better response because it's actually happening like a group work. Still five are wrong. So that's not justice. Okay. These are very small, very minute basics based on which you should correct your English. Okay. Now we are going to move on to the government officials about whom you people have written. So let us start with Ansh. Ansh, tell me about any one government official who belongs to a modest family. Narendra Modi. Okay, Ansh, you should not be presenting like this. Whenever we present on a stage, first of all, stand up. Stand up and with your notebook. And make the adjustment to the laptop or whatever, the screen, so that I can see you well. All right. So whenever you are here on the platform, on the stage, please remember, mark my words. When any person is on the platform, you need to respect the platform very well. Then only the platform respects you. Okay, ma'am. Right? So you have to first speak about, I'm going to tell you about two individuals. Just introduce your topic. And then one of them is uh, Sri Narendra Modi. And then you can talk about him. Okay, ma'am. Please start. Ma'am, Narendra Modi is again, our Prime Minister. Again, again. Shri Someone... Narendra Modi. Hello, everybody. I am so and so, and I'm going to talk about these two people from the modest financial background. Okay. Hello, hello, everybody. I am Ansh Bhardwaj. Today, mm -hmm. I will tell you about Shri Narendra Modi. Okay. He is our Prime Minister. Mm. What else? That's it. His political party name is Bharatiya Janta Party. Okay. What else? I have told you to write about his modest beginnings. How did he start and how did he become a government official? Did you read about him? No, ma'am. Why? See, I have been noticing you people are not doing your work properly. And this is really not fair. Apart from Narendra Modi, which uh, individual have you searched about? Ma'am, we don't have mobile phones. But you have computer access at your school. Do you? Ma'am, we don't use it. Why? Ma'am, not allowed. So there is no computer lectures in your school? No, ma'am. There are computer subjects is not there in your school? Um, computer subject, hey, ma'am. Then you do not attend the practical labs? Ma'am, we go, ma'am, but ma'am, we are in hostel, ma'am, so we can't go to the time. But in the school hours, you can search about it, can't you? No. Why? Again, Wi-Fi facilities are not available? Yes, sir, ma'am. Then? Ma'am, ma'am, practical karati hai. Okay. 
and so by this way nobody must have done the work kisi ne bhi kaam nahi kara ya kara hai kisi ne hmm kis no nobody do nobody but rishabh has told me he has done it mam only names what names have you got and where have you got those names from apj abdul kalam and narendra modi everybody has written the same name yes ma'am okay can you tell me something about apj abdul kalam what can you tell me something about apj abdul kalam apj abdul kalam was a student was a children of a fisherman who is very poor hmm ma'am he do part time job of selling newspapers okay. and and pay her school fees by selling newspapers pay her school fees or pay his school fees pay his school fees oh Okay have a seat and you to have a word with you people first have a seat again you need to adjust the screen see all of those who are in the class who are the part of this group we i have a special a special objective for you people to really really make you better individuals it's my request you know hand folded request that please uh, you know in case you do not get uh, any type of access to any uh, you know place or uh, how to do the homework if you get such issues you can inform me beforehand in the class that ma'am we will not get any access to the wifi we cannot do this homework i will try to sort out the problem at my end uh, in case it is possible but you need to tell me you have to be very very uh, frank with me in this case that what is the problem you are facing because for me your learning is very important at this point of time where i see you kids as is it as a at a good level but you still can you know go to the highest level abhi bhi if you people are speaking like ansh has just spoken i understand that he is very intelligent madhav is in fact all of you who are sitting here you are very very capable people but the point is how you are presenting in front of others matters the most remember raw data doesn't speak agar main kahu aap intelligent hain but aapko bolna hi nahi aata apni intelligence ko samne nahi rakhna aata nobody will look at you are you getting my words so if you have that power to make games if you have power to become an ies ips officer one day or maybe any uh, other individual you want to be but then you should have that power of speaking please uh, try to cooperate with me i only want your good okay so uh, madhav rishab who are having fun while listening to my words i do not know what is so funny about it but if you can just speak out to me that what's the problem what's the challenge then it would be helpful for both of us rishab what is it that makes you laugh you can give him mic and don't tell me nothing i told you don't tell me nothing what is it it cannot be nothing it is something we are here to study now what after discussion with digvijay have you got as an idea and digvijay tell me that bata de jo bol raha so bata do what is it kuch nahi then why were you laughing along with mother mother was it, was there anything funny about it did i say anything wrong when it comes to like giving a helping hand to you people was it wrong thing to say no ma'am just give me a moment okay ma'am okay chalo anyways uh, i am uh, like pretty committed that i really want to make you people uh, more effective than than ever you have been for now we are proceeding towards our story 
So let us start with that. And the way Ansh, you were explaining about APJ Abdul Kalam, I think it was good, but it could have been better had you used uh, past tense to explain your story. Okay. Now I want uh, Arav, you read it yesterday. Madhav will read it today. Madhav? Some time later, Jumping Mouse arrived at the great grassy plain. There he found a bison lying forlornly in the grass. Hello, bison, said Jumping Mouse. I am Jumping Mouse. Hello, Jumping Mouse. Please tell me how beautiful the sky looks today, said the bison sadly. Have you lost your sight? Asked Jumping Mouse with compassion. Yes, I am blind now, replied the bison. I do not know what I will do now that I cannot see. I am just an ordinary mouse, replied Jumping Mouse. But before I reached the great grassy plain, a magic frog gave me a new name. The frog named me Jumping Mouse. The name gave me extra strength in my legs. I will name you Eyes of a Mouse in the hope that your eyes will regain their No sooner had Jumping Mouse finished speaking, their strength, their strength. No sooner had Jumping Mouse finished speaking when the when the bison exclaimed, "I can see." Yes. So words play magic, right? You tell him he's a jumping frog. He gained the strength. You told him you are the eyes of a mouse. Mouse. You start seeing. So that's a bison, basically. That's how a bison looks like. Okay. And now Anhad will speak. Is Anhad here? Or has he left? I'm left. And with whose permission has he left the class? Is is any facilitator over there? Is any teacher over there? Yes, yes, ma'am. Has he asked the teacher? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, now, um, Athar, go ahead. At that every moment, Jumping Mouse realized he could no longer see. And I cannot see, said Jumping Mouse. Dear Jumping Mouse, said the bison, you have given me your eyes. I am so thankful. Let me do something for you. I am now on my way to the far off land, explained, explained Jumping Mouse. Thought how I will get there now. I don't do not know. Now, do, do not now. Came, jump, jump. Beneath. Beneath by enormous. Enormous means very huge. Please write this word in your uh, vocab log. Enormous means very huge. And how do you spell it? E O R M O U S and huge H U G E. Huge, very huge in size. Enormous. Please Hoops. continue, sir. Both and I will guide you across the grassy plain to the high mountain. Set the Bison. Bison. Okay. bison gently and with that they set off. What is the meaning of set off? To start a journey. Yes. And I can see Aaron has developed no interest in the story. Aaron, by any means, do you know what happened in this half? What happened in the story so far? Yes. 
no ansh will not tell you ansh no yes that's better let him be independent what happened in the story mayank aryan has no clue so mayank will tell me mayank am i starting se batana no 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 just uh, today what we have read um no idea no ma'am yash what have we started today see you people were playing i was seeing you you were fidgeting like anything he was fidgeting with his legs and you were fidgeting with your hair or arms or whatever arav any idea don't waste my time tell me you have an idea or you don't have an idea no what about mayank mayank you have any idea of what is the story all about yes ma'am tell me mayank speak have up have a story about a mouse yes and what have we done today mayank in our story what have we done today what have we read pass it on to uh, this guy daksh arav these are basic manners when you are yawning you should keep your hands on your mouth this is a story about a jumping mouse yeah tell me daksh what is the story story about jumping mouse hmm what did he do what did he do no idea are we sleeping has digvijay got an idea then then mouse to reach the next version the next land uh, then he found uh, a bison uh, which asked mouse to mouse uh, uh, how's the how's the sky looks like uh, and then the mouse said uh, uh, you, you you can't see and then bison said no i have uh, i am blind and then mouse and then mouse tell him the today's cl climate is very good and then uh, uh, bison said uh, you help me and now i will teach you to reach the mountain and right and they started good one dig vijay that's nice uh, so they were basically now uh, Uh, the jumping mouse has made uh, bison more powerful by giving his eyes to the bison and bison said that i will help you in crossing the fields and take you to the mountain okay you just keep jumping beneath my enormous hooves okay so hooves refers to the spiral uh, you know the horns basically here so you should keep jumping there only okay so the the horns will come from here and in the mouse will keep jumping he'll stop here keep jumping and he'll stop so this is how he wants him to move along with him and then he set off for the journey see here is he he doesn't have any eyes now and uh, bison can see so bison has promised him to uh, take him to the mountain okay the rest of the story we will uh, do tomorrow
okay we will keep uh, studying this uh, folk tale this is a folk tale of america frida kahlo was from mexico and this is a folk tale from america so guys i'm telling you you are really lucky that you are getting such a content but keep it in your mind what you are studying okay one fine day i will take your presentation also like today i have taken your quiz one fine day i'll take your presentation and in the presentation i will tell you how to stand and how to speak and how to deliver your words appropriately but if you want that day to come sooner you should start working on yourself quickly and do your work nicely okay uh, we'll we'll reach to, uh, towards the stage of public speaking also but for that i really need your cooperation that you are doing your work properly okay so here is a homework for you all i didn't get your yesterday's work although you have not done it but day before yesterday's work is also pending So this is a homework for you people. Write as many qualities as possible for this person. Should you need, uh, you know, Wi-Fi access for this thing? i will try my level best but you also have to put in efforts in case we get an access so you can use the labs and maybe other facility if possible and then we will see to it to generate a quality work okay you have to put lot of efforts in this Okay, so that is uh, all for the day. I'll be looking forward for this paragraph from you people. Okay. So that's okay, all for the class. Thank you so much. Bye-bye, everybody. Thank you, ma'am. Okay, you're welcome.